welcome to our documentary on Murad Ghazi bin Orhan bin Othman, the third Sultan of the Ottoman Empire and the leader of some of the most significant battles against the Byzantine Empire in Europe. Join us as we explore how he earned the title of Sultan, his conquests in Europe, the historic Battle of Kosovo, and how he expanded the Ottoman Empire while defeating Crusader armies multiple times. Murad Ghazi, born in 1326, was the son of Orhan, the second Sultan of the Ottoman Empire, and the grandson of Osman I, the founder of the dynasty. Growing up in a period of rapid Ottoman expansion, Murad was groomed for leadership from an early age. His upbringing was marked by rigorous training in military tactic, governance, and the arts of diplomacy and statecraft. Murad's father, Orhan, was a formidable leader who laid the groundwork for Ottoman dominance in Anatolia. As Murad came of age, he took on increasing responsibilities, preparing for the eventual transition of power. In 1362, upon the death of his father Orhan, Murad ascended to the throne as the third Sultan of the Ottoman Empire. His ascension marked the beginning of a transformative era for the Ottomans, as Murad focused on consolidating power and expanding the empire's territories. One of Murad's first actions as Sultan was to fortify the empire's hold over newly conquered territories in the Balkans. He established his capital at Edirne, strategically positioning the Ottomans to launch further campaigns into Europe. Murad's reign was characterized by relentless military campaigns and significant territorial expansion. One of his major early achievements was the capture of Adrianople, modern-day Edirne, in 1362, which became the new Ottoman capital and a base for operations in Europe. Murad's forces pushed deep into the Balkans, conquering parts of Bulgaria, Macedonia, and Serbia. His campaigns were marked by both strategic brilliance and overwhelming force, establishing Ottoman dominance in the region. In 1371, Murad achieved a decisive victory at the Battle of Maritza, where his forces annihilated a much larger Serbian army. This battle effectively ended Serbian resistance and opened the way for further Ottoman advances into the Balkans. One of the most significant battles during Murad's reign was the Battle of Kosovo in 1389. This battle was a pivotal moment in Ottoman history, marking their first major victory against a coalition of European forces. The battlefield, located in modern-day Kosovo, became the stage for a fierce and bloody confrontation. The battle saw Murad's forces face off against a Serbian-led coalition under Prince Lazar. Despite being heavily outnumbered, the Ottomans employed superior tactics and discipline, eventually securing a decisive victory. This victory solidified Ottoman control over the Balkans and struck a significant blow to European resistance. Tragically, Murad was assassinated in the aftermath of the battle by a Serbian noble who feigned surrender. Despite his death, the victory at Kosovo ensured that his legacy would endure, as his son Bayezid I took up the mantle of leadership and continued his father's expansionist policies. Throughout his reign, Muradwi not only expanded the empire's territory, but also secured it against multiple crusader attempts to halt Ottoman expansion. His victories against various European coalitions underscored the growing power and influence of the Ottoman Empire. Murad's strategic acumen and military prowess were evident in battles such as the Battle of Plaknik in 1386, where his forces defeated a large Serbian army. His ability to adapt and innovate in the face of diverse military threats played a crucial role in the empire's success. Beyond his military conquests, Murad I was also a visionary ruler who implemented significant administrative and cultural reforms. He established a centralized administration, reformed the legal system, and promoted education and the arts. Under Murad's patronage, the Ottoman Empire began to develop a distinct cultural identity. He encouraged the construction of mosques, schools, and other public works, fostering an environment of intellectual and artistic growth. These contributions laid the foundation for the Ottoman Golden Age. The legacy of Murad I is profound and far-reaching. 
His conquests and administrative reforms transformed the Ottoman Empire from a regional power into a formidable empire poised to dominate Southeast Europe and beyond. His strategic brilliance and visionary leadership paved the way for future sultans to expand and consolidate Ottoman rule. Today, Murad I is remembered as one of the key architects of the Ottoman Empire's early success. His military victories and governance strategies continue to inspire, highlighting the enduring impact of his reign on the course of history. The story of Murad Ghazi bin Orhan bin Othman is one of determination, vision, and transformation. His life and legacy remind us of the power of leadership and the enduring impact of strategic brilliance. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of one of history's most significant figures. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more captivating tales from the past.